Hello everybody and welcome back to another Citrus sound design tutorial. This time we are going to make a tropical house plug that for example Kaigo uses in his tracks. So to begin let's take the default preset here. Then let's go to the main tab and make the unison voices to 2. Also drag the face knob all the way up. By the way, this tutorial is going to be a little bit longer because there is a lot of ADSR and stuff we have to tweak here. But now let's turn on the oversampling to 8. Then let's go to operator 1. From here you want to select the square wave shape. Then let's turn the volume down a bit, somewhere around 60%. Let's route the sound to filter 1 and filter 1 to out. Then let's go to filter 1. Here you want to set the envelope to 48% and cut off to 9%. Go to volume, envelope and enable this ADSR. You want to have attack from 2 to 4%. This will make the clicking go away from the sound. Then set the DK to 25% and sustain all the way down. Okay, now let's go to cutoff envelope and enable envelope. From here, you only want to touch the attack knob and set it to 2 to 3%. Now let's go to wave shaper. Drag this tension down a bit like this and decrease the mix. Okay, now let's go to operator 2. And from operator 2 we want to make it down an octave. This will give more body to the sound. Then let's root operator 2 also to the filter one. All right, next operator three. This is going to be our noise operator. So let's turn the noise all the way up. Then let's root the noise, fil uh, noise operator to filter two. And let's go to filter two. This is going to be a high pass filter and we want the cutoff to be somewhere around 30%. Then let's route this filter to, to filter 3 here. And filter 3 will go to out. All right, then let's go to filter three. From here, you want to go to volume, envelope, and enable envelope. Let's decrease the attack to 5% and DK to 19%. Also take down the sustain. Then let's go to cutoff, envelope, enable envelope, and decrease attack to somewhere around 2 to 3%. Then set DK to 15.
Okay, let's decrease the volume of operator 3 a bit. And now let's go to operator 4. This will also be a square wave operator. And the volume of it will be 60%. Now let's route the operator also to filter 3. So now our operators are ready, but we need to uh, pan these filters a bit to make the sound a little bit more wider. So let's take filter 1 to the left and filter 3 to the right. Then let's enable FX for both filter 1 and filter 3. Now from the FX tab you want to have the chorus order 9 voices. Then enable the reverb and adjust the settings. So I'm going to take the low cut a little bit up, high cut to 16 kHz, also room size up and high damping up. Maybe a little bit more reverb. Okay, great. So now let's go to main tab and enable this EQ. Then let's decrease the lows a bit, somewhere around 180 hertz. And then let's make a boost to the high sounds somewhere around 1000 Hz. So that's pretty much it. Now let's make a quick loop and use this sound to hear how it sounds like when used in a beat. So here we go.